Hello. In one of my previous videos, I had discussed about setting up virtual host in Linux with Apache. So, which basically allows us to have a domain like wordpress.local pointing out to its own document root. Now, when you have set it up and probably before doing this, if you had your WordPress installation running already on the main document root, that's your where www html. What happens when you just move it from that location to another? So this is my WordPress, which is installed fine. Now, what I want to do is I want to simply move this WordPress from this location to the other location. So let's simply do one thing. We'll go to cd slash where slash www html and if you look at it over here i have my wordpress and i have also created a virtual host which is wordpress.local and this where www.html slash wordpress.local is its document root so like if i go to wordpress.local fine right now i'm getting this directory index so I would move my WordPress into this and my WordPress should start working from this particular location. Now, now first I will log out of this before doing anything. I'll just log out from my WordPress. And now I am going to move my WordPress from this location to the new one. So let's do one thing is I will use a tool called as midnight commander you can do it from the graphical interface if you like so over here I will switch to wordpress.local and inside that is the public HTML so this is where I want to copy this is what I have set up as my document root for wordpress.local fine so I've copied all this selected the files and I'm going to move them into this so okay so you can see my files have been moved to this location now if we go to wordpress.local what should happen is my wordpress page should come up now wordpress page is coming up let's try to log in over here that is wp-login.ph now you can see some issue is there page is not coming up properly let's try logging in and and if i try to log in it's giving me some error and why that error is there because it's going back to localhost fine it's not going to wordpress.local so the issue is that when you install wordpress it takes the domain name whatever domain name we when we installed WordPress, we directly use the domain name as localhost or we directly installed over here. So this is set into its database and that is what we need to update so that this works. So what we will do is we will go to localhost slash PHP MyAdmin. Basically, we have to update two entries in our WordPress database. So over here, either you can log in as root or if you remember your WordPress database username password, log in with that. So I'll just log in with this. Basically, we have to just edit this. So let's go to our WordPress database file. And over here, let's go to the options table. Here you will notice the first two entries which are there site url and home is set to this fine so we need to update this instead of local host we need to set it to whatever virtual host you have created so i will say wordpress not local fine make sure your entry is correct http is included into that and 
over here also wordpress dot local fine so this entries are done this is updated i can log out from here let's go back to our wordpress dot local okay obviously this page is coming up fine now we want to try to login so wp dash login dot php and now you can see the page is coming up properly so let's try logging in and here login and now this is going to work properly so if you are shifting your domain name or something this kind of issue can occur and hopefully this can help you.